An animal once thought to be extinct is now making progress in its reintroduction to the wild. Reporter Kayla Wall was on hand as the black-footed ferrets were released. Cowboys and horses aren't the only thing you'll see running around the Babbitt Ranch in northwest Arizona anymore. The release of 25 black-footed ferrets has been a longtime goal for wildlife specialists. It's been since 2007 at least that we've been working on getting ferrets back out here, um, probably even longer when the discussion started. The endangered species was thought to be extinct until 1981 when a small colony was found in Wyoming. Disease reduced the population to only 18, which were captured and placed into a breeding program. It was only about seven of those animals that were able to breed. So of all the ferrets that we have in the wild today, they basically came from 18 animals. The reintroduction of this group of animals is a small step in a much larger cause. The goal is to have a self-sustaining population and eventually get them taken off the endangered species list. The fact that we can have another site here in, in northern Arizona and hopefully help contribute to the recovery of black-footed ferrets, I think that's pretty amazing. In Williams, Kayla Wall, Cronkite News. The creation of this population now makes Arizona home to two separate colonies of black-footed ferrets.